from the roads to the skies. Hartsville Jackson International Airport is also expecting a record number of Thanksgiving travelers. I Liza Lucas inside right now. So Liza, what do travelers need to know as they head out to where you are this week? Good afternoon, Faith. Yes, experts are definitely saying be weather aware because depending on where you're headed, some of the bad weather out in the Midwest could impact your flight. The FAA warning that there also could be a shortage of air traffic controllers at some airports. So with all of that in mind, we want to point you to some new federal rules in effect to help you get your money back faster if your plans are interrupted. It's the first Thanksgiving. New rules from the U.S. Department of Transportation are in effect. And yet, some passengers say they had no idea such protections are now in place. I felt like they would have mentioned something if I had, once I bought my ticket. The new DOT rule creates new standards for when passengers are entitled to automatic refunds, an effort to take the burden from passengers who used to have to jump through hoops trying to figure out whether they'd get repaid if their plans get rerouted. I think in Europe, I had once I've gotten the flight canceled and they had that type of like flight assurance. So didn't realize that that's something in the U.S. With the switch, passengers are now entitled to an automatic refund. If your flight is canceled and the airline does not rebook you, your flight is canceled and you do not accept rebooking, or your flight is significantly changed and you don't want to travel with the new itinerary. The refunds must be issued within 7 to 20 days and be in cash or the original form of payment. But how does this shake out for the airline industry? A new study from travel site Upgraded Points takes a stab at that question, analyzing data from the Department of Transportation. The study estimating the new refund rule could cost airlines $5 billion every year. Actually, I was on the plane um, listening to the Secretary of Transportation. While only time will tell the true impact, Ronnie Medina Jr. is among the passengers who did catch the news and commends the extra support. And I think that's, that's a great idea. You know, to help all the customers, they get to um, have a for sure refund if, if you have an issue with delays and with everything that's going on. We also want to flag for you that there are new refund rules for significantly delayed baggage. So definitely look into that as well. We've got that all for you up online on 11alive.com. And at the same time, this study does caution that airlines in the future could have to adjust their operations or ticket prices in order to compensate for these new refund rules. Of course, if and when that happens, we'll be on top of it. Sydney, back to you.